Welcome again. Right now we're at 1 Corinthians chapter 3, verses 16 and 17. Your body is a temple of God. Paul writes, Don't you know that you are a temple of God and that God's Spirit lives in you? If anyone destroys God's temple, God will destroy him. For God's temple is holy, which you are. Notice that Paul talks like they should know about this. Like, don't you know that you're the temple of God? That your body, your physical body, is a temple of the Holy Spirit? How would these people know that? Paul talks like they should know. How would they know that? Well, you see, it is in the Torah. In the books of Moses, you will read time and time again the phrase that God is among you. The Lord our God is among you. That phrase, among you, is among you, can also be translated within you. The concept that your body is the temple of God is not just a quote-unquote New Testament thing. It goes all the way back in Scripture. That is why Paul rebukes these people. Like, Don't you know this? You should know this. Now, you see, here's the issue. There are a lot of people out there that claim to be believers, claim to be Christians, claim to love Jesus, claim to believe in the Bible, and claim to be born again. But they do a lot of things against their physical body that harms it. Hey, even in the next couple chapters, we're going to read about how Paul says that sexual immorality is sin against your own body. That's one thing. But then there are the other issues such as smoking, drinking too much, recreational drugs that harm your body, junk food that harms your body, gluttony that harms your body, all this stuff that harms your body. You ought to be very careful of what you do to your body. You ought to be very careful that you do not do anything sexually immoral that harms your body. You ought to be very careful you don't do anything that could harm you, be it smoking, be it drinking too much, be it the use of recreational drugs, anything that could harm your body. Lots of junk food, lots of gluttony, things that could hurt your body. Because don't forget, your body is God's temple. Can you imagine how angry God would be if someone just went up to God's temple in Moses' day and just trashed it or just did some kind of harm to it? If you are truly a believer, if you are truly a Christian, you need to be very careful about what you do to your body. Treat your body with utmost respect because, hey, you know what? Really, it's not your body. It is God's body. And we're going to read this later on in the next few chapters as well. Don't you know you were bought with a price? You were purchased with a price? You are not your own? Until then, seek God with all your heart. And if you do, you will find him. Call upon him and he will show you great and mighty things. Love you guys.